Hello guys, in today's video, we're going to check out the best tablet camera in this year. I made this list based on my personal opinion, and I've tried to list them based on their price, quality, durability, and many more. To find out more information about these tablet camera, you can check out the description below. If you want to get a best quality tablet camera according to your needs, then watch the video till the end and then decide to buy. At the first position of our list, we have iPad Pro 12.9 mode. The best tablet camera experience you can get at the moment comes from the very latest iPad. The iPad Pro 12.9 mode, 2021. On the rear you get 12MP wide and 10MP ultra wide rear cameras, along with a time of flight to FYDAR scanner for depth. This setup offers video capture up to 4K at up to 6 diffs and full HD. 1008 dive capture it up to 204 diffs. It's worth noting that these stats are exactly matched on the previous model, the Apple iPad Pro 12.9 2020. Subtle improvements to performance have been made, though. For example, the 2021 iPad Pro boasts Smart HDR3 software compared to Smart HDR on its predecessor and offers extended dynamic range for video up to 30 diffs. Overall, though, if the rear camera was your only concern, you might opt for the cheaper 2020 model. Number two on our list, where the 2021 truly trumps its predecessor, however, is in the front-facing camera. That's jumped up in quality from 7MP on last year's model to 12MP. It also now boasts an ultra-wide view which, thanks to the new center stage feature, means you're automatically cropped into shop when on a video call or taking a selfie. Moving on to the next and number two with iPad Pro 12.9, 2020. Want an iPad with a decent tablet camera, but on a tight budget. As we mentioned above, the latest iPad Pro for 2021 is the absolute best there is, but the more affordable 2020 model comes a very close second. After all, you're still getting the same 12MP wide and 10MP ultra wide rear cameras, along with the time of flight to FYDR scanner for depth. Video capture up to 4K at up to 6 diffs and full HD, 1008 I capture it up to 204 diffs. The main compromise is that the front-facing camera drops down from 12MP to 7MP and doesn't have the automatic centering feature. The other big difference is that the 2021 iPad Pro is much, much faster. So if you're doing very resource-intensive tasks, such as video editing, that might make a difference to your productivity. If that's not the case, though, and the front camera isn't important to you, we probably advise opting for the more affordable 2020 iPad Pro. The number three position is held by Microsoft Surface Pro 8. Want a Windows tablet with a decent camera? Then we recommend the latest Microsoft Surface Pro. This two-in-one tablet slash laptop hybrid boasts a 10MP rear-facing autofocus camera with 1008 HD and 4K video plus a 5MP front-facing camera with 1080i Full HD video. The rear camera offers clean and clear images, and the extra 2MP bump from the Surface Pro 7 really makes a difference to the level of detail you can capture. The front camera, meanwhile, does a surprisingly good job of conducting video calls as long as your room isn't overly dim. That's thanks to an ambient color sensor in the front camera, which Microsoft has added to this new Surface Pro for improved brightness and color. It also allows you to log into Windows while using just your face. There are plenty of other improvements over the Surface Pro 7 II, including a boost in RAM from 4GB to 8GB, a bigger and brighter 13-inch display, and longer battery life. Plus, it runs the latest Windows 11 operating system. That means this isn't just the best tablet camera for Windows users available today, it's the best Windows tablet, period. Next at number 4, we have Samsung Galaxy S8 Tab Ultra. The Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 Ultra has just been released for 2022 and has the best tablet camera for Android users we've seen to date. On the rear, you get two cameras, a wide and an ultra-wide. The first sports a 13MP sensor, measuring 1-3.4-inch, an f-2 lens, and a 26 in focal length. That second boasts a 6MP ultra-wide sensor with an f-2.2 aperture. There are also two selfie cameras, both featuring 12MP resolution. With auto-framing, you can position your tablet and move around in front of it, and it will choose the optimal framing for you. And both front 
and rear camera support 4K at 6 diffs. This is a great tablet in general too. It's ultra thin at just 5.5mm thick and boasts a huge 14.6-inch Super AMOLED screen that's great for watching movies and working in creative apps like Photoshop. It offers superior picture quality with a 1848x2960 resolution, deep blacks, zingy colors, and a fast refresh rate of 120Hz. The Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 processor with 816GB RAM does a great job of running Android 12. The S Pen has been redesigned and improved, and a powerful 11,200 mAh battery promises up to 14 hours of video playback. The number 5 position is held by Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 Plus. The Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 Plus isn't quite as powerful overall as the new S8 Ultra, number 4 on our list, but in terms of the cameras, it's not far off at all. And so if you can save money by buying this slightly older tablet, it is definitely worth considering. On the rear, you get 13MP wide and 5MP ultra wide cameras, and you can capture 4K video at 3rd. On the front, meanwhile, you get an 8MP front facing camera for your video calls and selfies. This is a pretty great tablet in general too. Its Qualcomm Snapdragon 865 Plus processor is super speedy. The 10,000 mAh battery will keep going for hours. The S Pen stylus is a joy to use for photo editing. And the 12.4-inch Super AMOLED screen delivers a lovely, high-res picture quality. The number 6 position is dominated by Microsoft Surface Go 2. If you're looking for an affordable Windows tablet with a decent camera, then look no further than the Surface Go 2. Despite the low price, you're getting a very good 8MP autofocus rear camera that shoots 1080p video. The 5MP front camera lets you stream in 1080p too, which gives it the edge over many similarly priced laptops, which tend to be stuck around the 720 mark. More generally, the Surface Go 2 is a 2-in-1 device that can be transformed into a laptop when combined with Microsoft's type cover, sold separately. It's not the fastest or most powerful device, Hence it runs by default in Windows 10S mode, which restricts you to apps from the Windows Store only. However, battery life is good, and overall this is a great budget choice for kids, students, or just anyone who wants to keep their cost low. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Samsung Galaxy Tab 10.5. If you're seeking a cheap Android tablet with a good camera, check out Samsung Galaxy Tab 10.5 2018. It's a few years old now, hence the reduced price, but it's still a good performer. Photography-wise, you get an 8MP f/1.9 camera on the rear, while in the front you'll find a 5MP f/2.2 selfie camera. These perform as well as you can expect in an older model. Plus, there are some nice tools in the camera app, including night capture, panorama, and a pro mode that lets you adjust things like white balance and ISO. Both can capture 1080 video a third of. Obviously, this is not the most powerful or up-to-date Android tablet. With just 3GB RAM and running an older version of the operating system 8.1, but it copes with most things pretty well. And for this price, you won't find better. The number 8 position is held by iPad Mini 2021. Tablets tend to be quite big and cumbersome, making them not so great for taking pictures with. If, for this reason, you'd rather opt for something on the small side, We'd recommend the latest iPad Mini, the best tablet camera you'll find in a compact size. Its rear camera sports the same 12MP sensor as the iPad Pro. This is capable of capturing 4K video at up to 6 diffs. On the front, meanwhile, there's an excellent 12MP selfie slash video call camera. This employs the center stage feature that automatically centers you in picture and can capture 1080 video at up to 204 diffs. Elsewhere, the 8.3-inch screen offers a gorgeous high-quality display. With vivid colors, you get excellent performance thanks to the speedy Apple A15 processor. And the tiny size and weight means it's easy to carry everywhere. Finally, the number 9 position is dominated by iPad 10.2. 2019. Want an iPad but short of fonts? The best budget iPad available today is the iPad 10.2. 2019. And it's got quite a bit to offer photographers. Its 8MP rear camera provides sharp and clear images with good, strong colors. It features HDR and can capture 1080 video at third of. On the downside, the 1.2MP front-facing camera is not great at all. 
And on the whole, this model is more basic than the latest, expensive iPads. But as long as you're not using it for important voice calls and you're not bothered about selfies, this is the best iPad available for a cheap price today. That's all for today. We upload camera, camera accessories review videos every single day. So don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.